Okay, so good morning. Um, I just wanted to talk about my beliefs in in Christianity and my experiences of being in the church from 2005 to 2021 at this point in time and what I've learned along the way and probably where it all come from as a kid and my family and stuff like that. So traditionally, my family is either Anglican or Presbyterian or take your pick, those sort of Protestant traditional type things. And um, so growing up as a, a younger child, you went to church when someone got baptised or married or whatever. Like the, You didn't go to church every week. You didn't pray or read the Bible or things like that. So it was very traditional, meaningless, sort of pathetic, really. Um, when I was about 11, 10, somewhere around there, we, we actually we moved out to Charleville. I'm from Queensland, Australia. So this is my experience from from this country because I I get the feeling it's different in different other countries. So anyway, so we um, started going to that church. There was Bible study there, actually. I, I remember starting with Laurie Peake and the guys, and um, we started going every week. And um, then that went on um, until... I was probably about 14 and then we we just stopped going to church and um and things like that and then um by the time I was 17 mum and dad had, had a divorce big horrible split family members took side and some very awful horrible things were said and done uh, by all parties and including myself um I was very hurt um because I felt like these people that you love, who are meant to be these Christian people, turn against you and lie and backstab you and um, treat you like you're just you're a dog who's being disobedient. Really, is is that how that went? So at that point, I was like, well, you know what? You can jam your God and your religion and yourselves, and off you go, and I'll see you all later. So it wasn't all my family, just probably half. So off, so I was very hurt. Off I went, um, turned my back on God, really, and just said, "Well, you know, like if 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 that is the God that these people have, that's a really." Oh no, it's still going. I thought my phone, had, the camera had stopped. I was about to get annoyed at it. Um, what what what's the point? Like this 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 is like hopeless. Like the way that they treated people and the way that they acted, the things they said you know, was not not very good. And I thought that's what God and who God was. So I was like, no, nah, I don't want nothing to do with it. So off I went. Ten years in the wilderness, really. Drugs, alcohol, all sorts of things that, wow, I should not have done. Um, feel pretty bad for, really, later down the track. Uh, you make mistakes, I guess, every day. We're not perfect. So um, now my mum remarried. Uh, a Christian man, uh, they went to church every week. Uh, they went to a COC church. So you kind of completely different thing here. You've got this fairly traditional Presbyterian upbringing, old hymn books, no instruments sort of thing to mum to come to this other church where all sorts of wacky stuff going on. Um, a band, you know, playing music and stuff, which was for me, I'm a musician. I play in the music band here in our local church. So I was just like, wow, well, I didn't see that coming. I didn't know church was like that at all or could be like that. So totally different thing. So go to about 2005, I've just got married. I've got the second young child. Um, uh, if you think you're going to get married and your life's going to get easier when you've got problems and your wife's got problems and you're coming together, no, it's it, you're both going to come with lots more problems and create more problems. And... Add on top of that, where I'd just come from with my other family, you know, the whole fight. And it was still really ongoing, even by this point. It was still, there was still elements ongoing. You know, sides were definitely drawn, lines were drawn. It was just like, it could have been a family feud that went on for a thousand years, <coughs> sort of thing. Excuse me. So anyway, so uh, I was at church. Mum had actually come to church, come to church, come to church. And I'm like, oh, for goodness sake, whatever. I'll, if you just shut up, I'll come to your stupid church. Just be quiet. I'm sick of hearing you. Um, 
So anyway, so she... Uh, the thing is turned off. So I, I go I go to this um, this church and I'm sitting there and I, I can't remember what the pastor was talking about, but it was like, wow. I really felt a, a conviction that I was... I just was wrong and that wandering around and being has hurt and hurting other people in that process was not what God wanted for me and that there was a different version of God than the one that I saw at that time. Um, yeah. And I went home because uh, I was away at the time and I went back with the kids. Uh, I took the two girls with me. I looked to the wife, oh, we're going to church now, and and I want to go to church. And she was like, oh, my goodness, like, why would you want to do that? Because she had come from something similar with her, her family, and her first husband, you know, did the religion church thing um, and turned out really badly. So and that, I think that's what I've learned from my first early experiences with church is that there's religion, and there's what people do, and there's tradition, and then there's the truth. And I think there's a big, massive difference between the two. Okay, thank you.